Hey developer and welcome to this Our Code World free course about Symfony 5. The idea of this course is to provide you with exceptional content that you will need in your professional career when working with the most awesome PHP framework of all time, Symfony, without spending a single time. My name is Carlos and I will be your instructor in this Symfony course. I'm the founder of Our Code World, a blog where I write about programming with different technologies, such as C Sharp, PHP, Python and so on. I've worked as well as a freelancer and employee on a lot of projects of different complexities for more than 6 years, from very basic blocks and database management applications to important platforms that handle high traffic and require therefore high reliability. By the end of this free course, you should be able to use Symfony to create very basic web pages as well as complex applications that may allow you to interact with third-party APIs or even better, offering your own API built with Symfony. I will walk through every basic aspect of Symfony in this course from the very beginning, so if you are already familiar with the Symfony file structure, the hardware and software requirements, among other things, you may skip some chapters of this course if you want. You can as well slow down or speed up the video if you find my accent tedious, as I am from Colombia, South America. The video transcription can be found on the respective chapter of the course that you can find on the blog or in the video description. If you ever get lost when I type the code, you shall be able as well to obtain the code in the transcription of the video or in the git repository of the Symfony 5 project on which we will work on this course. Having said all that, let's get started with one of the most important things that you will learn in this course. What is Symfony? Symfony is an open source PHP framework that uses the MPC or Model View Controller architecture. It's as well at the same time a set of reusable PHP components that you can embed in your own plain PHP projects that use Composer or other PHP frameworks, just like Laravel or CodeIgniter. The first version of Symfony was released in 2005 under the MIT license. Nowadays, in 2021, the latest stable release is 5.2. Quite a lot of development, isn't it? The main goal of Symfony is to help you with the hectic coding, saving you precious development time, simplifying very regular tasks as the creation of forms, session handling, cookies, manipulation of databases through the doctrine ORM, among other important things that we'll cover in this course. I will try to be so charismatic and clear as possible so you can understand everything that will happen in the videos. So I hope to see you in the next chapter.